So today's registration day for the, the World Cup. So just gonna go down now and walk you through it all. How much weight in at windsurf contest? Uh, it's only been two hours. <laughs> <laughs> Two hours thirty later. What is the registering? All those photo shoots we did. Yeah. Steering sales. There you go, for anyone interested, that's what I'm going to eat today. Um, some eggs, I'm going to make a little shake with some of this protein stuff as well. I might even put a bit of tuna in with some scrambled egg. You get free lunch here if you sign up to the event, but um, I have to say they're a bit mean on the portions. Um, so yeah, I'm going to have to make some more food now. But yeah, just a little update from today, we had our registration sign up thing whatever but which took way way too long i think we were there for a couple of hours but anyway that is uh that's what competition's about a lot of waiting and uh yeah now they're sending out the the kids um the youth fleet just making sure i've got some fuel down me in case i do compete this is um this is the kitchen if you were wondering this is um this is the cave that we're staying in um not not staying in luxury at all really actually i was with profit for a few days and finn as well but profit's um got a nice swanky new apartment which he's moving to so um lucky bugger so i'm here this week by myself um so i went over to victor's earlier did all my sticker sticker and other sales um and now we're just gonna wait a little bit to see what the conditions are doing um but from what the locals are saying um, it's gonna, it's gonna pick up, or the waves are gonna pick up anyway. It's, pr it's pretty windy. As you can see, that's our window. Um, just gonna get some things ready, and uh, might even join Ben in the commentary booth for a bit. And in the air, maybe a bit of frustration creeping in. If it doesn't find a jump here. We might see a squeeze out. In that's it really, just finished um, finished a little bit of commentary with Ben today, um, they only had the juniors on, juniors and the youth, um, but yeah and I think tomorrow there should be slalom action, um, so I'm not sure I'll be competing tomorrow, uh, but everything's kind of ready and stick it up, and, uh, but yeah, um, I don't know how interesting this has been, I'm trying to think what else there might be interesting to say, oh, um, yeah, they've had a bit of a format change with how they're doing it this year, which is quite interesting. So instead of normally here them doing a single elimination and then a double elimination, um, they're doing a single with a rep charge round in the quarterfinals or something, um, which basically means that um, if they can only do a single, they will have sort of the top seeded or the top 10 riders a little bit more sorted out. So instead of getting like a joint fifth and a joint ninth or whatever, they will have, um, you know, first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, up to, up to 10, I think, I believe. So that's interesting, a bit different. And also they're gonna be doing a four man heats, um, which is also different. So normally here they do have four guys in the water but it's two against two um so this year they're changing it up the judges are actually having they're gonna have three judges just watching the jumps and three just just watching the wave rides um which means that um they can judge everyone in the heat um fairly um which i think it will make it fairer because there's been times in the past where um they've had the two man heat two against two with four people in it and um 
one of the guys from who came second in the in one of the heats would have actually gone through because his score would have been higher than um, the other guys uh, who came first in the other in the other heat. Hopefully, I'm making a bit of sense here. Um, so there's a few things that are a little bit different this year, which is interesting. So um, exciting to see um, how that will work out. And then, yeah, and then I think from what I've heard, if they do a double elimination, um, it would just be like a normal double to start with. And then they will basically just stop till they get to top 10 or whatever. Um, so it gives people probably like me, who will get knocked out early a little bit of a chance, but then there won't be any super final or anything like that going on. So if you come second in the overall, you can't come back and um, in the double and, and try again. So it's interesting changes. Um, see how see how it goes. But yeah, that's me for today. Um, gonna go and have some pizza and watch some football. I think so. Catch you guys in a bit. <laughs> <laughs> Careful, there's a table. <laughs>